Welcome to Matta's Own HD Sportsnet, presented by the JMU Alumni Association. We're here with women's soccer head coach Dave Lombardo in College Park, Maryland, following a 1-0 uh, victory in overtime on a game-winning goal by Ashley Herndon. Coach, talk about the game. It was, uh, it was a very tough game. Uh, Maryland's a very good side. Uh, I think they really took it to us in the first half. I think they had something like, I don't know, nine or ten uh, corner kicks. So they had a lot of the ball and a lot of offense in the final third. Um, we kind of rearranged some uh, personnel and uh, played better in the second half and had some really good chances. So uh, uh, I don't know what the final tally was on shots, but we, uh, we got after it pretty good in the second half. We rang one off the crossbar late uh, in the game. That, I think, obviously would have turned the tide there. But this just showed a lot of senior leadership, uh, upper-class leadership with both Rachel Ivey, who's a senior, and Ashley Herndon who's a, a junior, uh, they fought for a loose ball. Rachel dug it out and played Ashley uh, in and for the game winner. And I, I told the girls uh, at the end of the regulation time, it's golden goal. All you need is one shot. It's, it's about a lot of energy and a lot of belief in each other, and they uh, really rose to the occasion. Yeah, as you mentioned, Maryland did have a lot of set-piece opportunities there, but the defense as well as Ellen Forrest and goal really held strong and forced overtime. Uh, what really do you see as a key to them doing that? Well, you know, right now, uh, three weeks ago, that was uh, an issue for us. We were new, and we were not used to each other, and we were a little unsettled, and Ellen was spending way too much time having to direct people. Now that this has gelled a little bit better, and the understanding collectively as a defense is good, and Ellen can focus on being a goalkeeper, and she's doing a great job with that. Okay, well, it was a very exciting win. The next game you guys have is Sunday uh, afternoon mm -hmm. against LaSalle at home. Uh, yep. Talk a little about that matchup going Yeah, on. LaSalle's another tough team. Uh, lost to Maryland 1-0, uh, but I watched a, a bit of the tape, and that uh, was a game that really could have gone either way, too. A uh, very vi uh, physical type of team, a physically big team. They have a lot of kids that are 5'8 to 5'10 or so. So it's going to be a handful uh, for us. So uh, I'm excited that uh, they've beaten us. The last two years, two to one, uh, we're hoping we can turn the tables on them. Right, well, once again, congratulations on the exciting win. Have a safe trip home. Great. Thanks, Nate.